Minneapolis, Minnesota, St. John's pick it up in the first half. Minnesota down by 10. Gophers actually trail by as many as 13. Ahmad Gilbert for three. Gophers coming back down by seven. This was a breakout game for Amir Coffey. The steal, stroll, and slam. Coffey had 30. Minnesota earned its first lead of the night. Seconds left in the first half. The lead is up to seven. Nate Mason feeding Gilbert again. 26-7 run to finish the first half. Gophers up by 10 at the break. Second half, the lead is up to 13. Mason look ahead to Jordan Murphy. He can go with two hands. Gophers lead it 46-31. Then Eric Curry off the miss, gets his own board and looks underneath for Murphy. Two-handed Thunder Chunky Gophers up 53-38. And then Coffey driving. Murphy gets the rebound and put back. Gophers go on to win it 71-692-86, I should say. After the game, Richard Pitino with Stephen Bardo. Coach, thanks a lot for joining us. What did you say to your team when you guys were down 22-9 and made that incredible turnaround? Well, last couple of games we've made big runs and it's really changed the momentum of the game. And I told them during a timeout, relax. You had, to, you had to let them punch you in the mouth first to know you were in a fight. They regrouped. It was stops and rebounds is really it. They were really rebounding the ball. I think they saw a thin team and they didn't realize they were going to play really hard, attack the glass. So we got stops and rebounds and that's how we got out on the break. You talk about stops. Reggie Lynch was outstanding defensively. All the block shots without really getting in foul trouble. Yeah, he's, he's tough like that. He's got great timing. It's a little bit unorthodox at times. Um, but yeah, to get nine blocks was impressive. I thought our assist to turnover ratio, I mean, 18 to six was really good. Obviously those two guards are tough. Made some tough shots at the end, but that's a really good win for our program. And what about Amir Coffey? 30 points as a freshman. I mean, he, he looks unfazed on the floor. You know, I had a rule that lasted three games, no freshman talking to the media. I lifted it. I said, he's got he's to have his due. He's going to be a great player. Um, you know, he just finds a way to get to the rim. He's just scratching the surface. He's a great kid, um, and, and he loves putting on that Minnesota uniform. Well, congratulations on a great victory, Coach. Thank you. All right. Back to you guys in studio.